what's up guys? There's a big clump of areca palms growing in central Florida. And some pygmy date palms. And a big sable with a squirrel in it. See the squirrel? Three clumps here. One, two, and three. Areca palms. Some people I think call them bamboo palms because they the trunks kind of look like bamboo. You have to continuously cut them as you see here. So keep putting out more shoots multiplying their clumping palms but they're nice they work good for privacy they kind of make a little little private area back here so you can come back across if you want shade or whatever and this resort here they don't really fertilize anything if you look here they don't these aren't fertilized a lot of them are yellowing a bit and they're not uh they're definitely not looking as good as they could i've noticed a lot of the palms around here they got a queen right here beside it all completely penciled out there's no top, yellowing leaves, and the trunk is super skinny. The higher up it gets, it's really thick when it's planted. I got one there that's very sickly. The tree looks like it's producing almost no foliage. It's a huge piece of trunk, and then it just stops. They don't really, I don't think they care. They got infinite palms. The pygmy dates, though, they seem to not care. The pygmy, the sables don't seem to care either. They stay dark green. They have very low, uh, like, fur uh, requirements. Nutritional requirements. I'm gonna get another quick view of this queen. See it right here. Pencil right out. My trunk when they planted it, probably like that. Thanks for walking, lady. 